Hey, welcome back parents and students to another weekly update. We're going to do this a little bit different. I figured uh, seeing a PowerPoint slide will help you navigate what you need um, throughout this YouTube video. So for the week of May 11th, here we go. Moving forward. So this is the schedule for Hula Block 1. You're going to see some changes here for Hula Block 1. The biggest change is the Kahoot on Monday, Kahoot on Zoom at 11 a.m. This is optional. You don't have to do it. It's a mix of all three Hula Blocks, humanity, language, art, humanities, language, arts blocks. We're talking about Block 1, Block 3, and Block 4 are welcome to join this. You don't have to. It won't be held against you if you don't do it. But afterwards, there is going to be a question and answering session, and we will need to follow rules also, meaning questions and answers, questions you may have and answers I might have for you in terms of your assignments, uh, in terms of things turned in, and maybe the due dates on certain things, right, and grading. Tuesday, we come back to Newsday Tuesday. This time we're on ancient China. Now, this is for Hula Block 1, mind you. Hula Block 3 and 4 will be a little different, and then we go back into the Arizona Smith uh, videos that we have done before with questions on Canvas, and then IXL and catch-up days for Thursday, Friday. So we're moving on from Rome. We're moving forward with ancient China, more specifically the Silk Road. Here is the schedule for Hula Block 3 and 4. My afternoon groups have pretty much the same setup except for Tuesday. Tuesday, you're going to do the Pirates assignment. Uh, you will need your ancient Civ book. I will send a PDF version of that chapter on ancient China. So for those who do not have the book or maybe you misplaced it, you can use that instead, an electronic version that I'll be sending soon. I'll try to send it along with the weekly update email on Sunday as well, depending on how big the file is. But everything else is pretty much the same if you look here. Again, it's optional, all blocks. One, three, and four are welcome to do the coot and the question answering. And the difference for three and four compared to block one, you're doing pirates instead. So moving forward, you might wanna screenshot this guy right here. Here's the meeting ID for 11 a.m. Kahoot Zoom meeting. The password is Rome, R-O-M-E. So again, here's the meeting ID, 927-5593-5512, R-O-M-E, small caps. Again, optional, meaning you don't have to. But it would be really great to see you guys, really great to bring it back to the Kahoot um, that we used to do when we were back in school, right? So screenshot this guy. Now, how do we play it? Uh, Kahoot can be played double screen or two devices. So you can split screen it, one with the Zoom. So if you look here, one has the Zoom and the other one will have Kahoot. You need to download the Kahoot app. So one with the Zoom, one with the Kahoot app. I would say that is the easiest method to go about doing this. If you have multiple devices, maybe you have a, a laptop, uh, maybe you have your iPad or a cell phone, then you can play the game on the cell phone and then watch me on the iPad on the other device, or you can watch the Zoom on, on the laptop or on the separate device or the iPad as you play on your phone. So you have two options how to do it, but you you can have two devices where you're doing the, the Kahoot on a different um, device and then watching it on a separate device, or you can have it on one device, but you're split screening. Okay, so again, figure it out, play around with it before Monday if you're deciding to do this so that you know, and I am going to include an e, uh, not an email, but a YouTube video that does show you the breakdown of this, and I did send it earlier before with the Kahoot, um, the, the Kahoot survey before. All right, let's move on. Rules for tomorrow's Kahoot. Here are the rules for tomorrow's Kahoot. So you will be muted during the game. Um, you will get three mo uh, three warnings till you're booted. If you're goofing off, we're talking about, right? If you actually have a legitimate question, please feel free to do it. If you're just messing around, this is not the place to mess around. You'll have a chance to talk to me, a chance to talk to other students uh, after the Kahoot. So try not to get booted. Don't act up. I will warn you. I'll probably put on the messages on the side send you a direct message or I'll just stop the code and I'll say something um, just to stop it, okay? 
um, but you will automatically be brought in um, muted. And then afterwards, then we'll, we'll move forward with some questions and answers. You can raise your hand physically on the video or there's a little button that says raise hand and you can do it that way and I'll be able to see it. So I, I hope that I'll get to see you guys tomorrow. I'm, I'm hoping that, not tomorrow, sorry. Yeah, tomorrow, that's right, this Sunday. What am I talking about? I'm losing my mind. Um, so hopefully I'll get to see you guys on Monday, 11 a.m. It's, it's optional, not necessary. Try to use this time to really catch up, guys. Um, a lot of you are caught up, so good. But uh, you don't want things to pile. You don't want that time. We've talked about this in class before. So do your best to really get caught up. And if you are struggling with that, please email me. Maybe there's something we, what, something we can do, something I can help you with. Maybe you're just stuck on a question or maybe the technology is failing you. Let me know. Uh, besides that, I hope to see you Monday, 11 a.m. If not, email me uh, and uh, we'll start from here. Start from there. Start on 11 a.m. Whenever you're ready to start, really. Right? All right. Have a good one, guys. Stay safe and hopefully see you Monday.